Hey guys, we're here with Mike Ross, who's the music director for Fame, the musical happening here at the Marina Theater in Medina Jamira from now until March 5th. Fifth or fourth? Am I getting that right? Someone want to shout that one out here? Fourth, fifth? Huh? No? I'm pretty sure it's That's, the fifth. I think it's, it's a fifth. It's one of those days yeah. we'll throw it in it's in the, the description fifth. below. It's the fifth. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Great. So, Mike. I'm going to let Emma throw the first question at you, sure. but I think I actually want to throw one question here first, actually, so I'm going to take, I'm going to let you have the second question. Oh, fine, whatever. What does a music director do? Music director, yeah. we, uh, every, well, at first I start down with the singers and I teach them the whole show. Uh, musical is full of music, so they learn their harmonies, they learn their solo parts, things like that. Um, if there's an orchestra or a live band, it's rehearsing with the musicians and piecing the two things together, the singers and the music. In this case, we're using tracks, so there's a lot of editing tracks and things like that, and you know, just making it work with the show, building all the underscoring, things like that. Music shapes the show, so okay. it's building in that way. All right. Emma, what do you got? Uh, well, I'm throw gonna, him a heart ball. I'm going to throw, yeah, uh, for a festival welcome. Uh, Thank you. Welcome Thank to you. Dubai. Is it Thank your first you. time here? It is my first time here. Oh, yeah. excellent. I love Dubai. I apologize excellent. for the weather. It's uh, normally much warmer. Oh, uh, I hear that. This must be nice, though, right? This is similar to where I'm from, so okay. this is good. I'm where liking are you from? it. I'm from originally the east coast of Canada, Nova Scotia. Ah, okay. uh, but I, thought living, I, I thought I heard a little bit of a little, there. There's a little yeah. bit of an accent, but okay. I'm currently living in Toronto right now. There's lots of snow. There's lots of ice. I grew up just across the lake from there. Oh, so you get it. I know. You get I it. Know. So yep. Dubai's lovely. <laughs> Dubai is amazing. Dubai is yeah. amazing. Anyway, Sorry. back Emma to has fame. A question. <laughs> so I'm going to start with a very easy question. Sure. Why should people come and see your version of Fame? Oh, Fame is so fun. It's so high energy. I'm sure we can all relate going back to school and being in the classroom. You have your, your kids, that the students that play sports and the kids that are into theater and music and the kids that like to be in their books. Uh, and uh, there's so many high dance numbers. There's a lot of energy. Everyone's so funny. There's so many little funny bits. Everyone has their own little character and their little things that they throw around with each other. Uh, you know, there's the cranky teacher that's coming at them and stuff. And it's such an easy show for everyone to relate to. Yeah. And uh, the dance numbers are huge. Um, it's just exciting. It's, it's so much fun. How does how does this show relate to some of the other ones in the past, like the West End show and the 25th anniversary show that was on a few years ago? This one's a little bit more modern. Um, okay. We tried to adapt a little bit to, to you know appeal to kind of what school is like today a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, the show comes from the 80s, so yeah. it's it's a little dated. So we tried to put that spin onto it. We didn't change the music or anything like that, but tried to just you know put a bit of modern feel into it. Yeah. So, yeah. What's the audience for this? Who do, who do you think is the best person to go with? Is it, is it someone like me who's... You know, I think it's for everyone really okay. all over. It really He's is very musical adverse. I have to throw that out oh, there. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I learned something about myself today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's kind of for everybody. You know, like I said, it's so high energy. The dance numbers are huge. Mm -hmm. The lighting is great. The singing is great. Um, you know, from old to young, I think it's a fun, it's a fun number. It's yeah. a family show, for sure. You've got quite a mix of characters in that cast, correct? We do. We do. Who do you most identify with? Well, before I did music directing, I did teach. Um, so I, I relate okay. to Miss Myers. I relate to her character. And she's a bit crankier than I was. Um, she's very stern. She lays the law down. Um, I'm more like the other teacher that you'll meet in the show, Miss Bell. Um, I like to have a little bit more fun with the students and mm -hmm. you know, crack the jokes and, and have a good time. So definitely her. So obviously famous about high school students. It is. Um, how do you, how, how young is your cast actually? How many of them are actually high school age versus like young 20s? Uh, or is it like in the film where you have 35 year olds, yeah. 18 yeah. year olds? Definitely not. They're definitely not in high school. Um, everyone on stage have graduated uh, mm -hmm. college or university in some way. They're all trained in eyes of theater acting, things like that. Some of them though, you know, only a few years out of high school though. Okay. So they're still young at heart. We're still fresh. So what's it like to deal with a, such a young cast then? Uh, well, it helps in the show okay. because you know they're not too far off from the age, so that definitely yeah. that definitely helps. Um, you kind of need that energy, you need that spunk. I think if we were dealing with an adult, say 50, 60, you know, that's you know, no offense to people who are that age, but you gotta like pull yourself back a few years and remember what yeah. it's like to be a student in high school again. Those split Granted, jumps are gonna be a little bit difficult, the, right? Yeah, I think I, the split jumps and the flips are a little bit difficult. I think absolutely. there's an idea here, by the way. We need okay. to do we need to do fame the musical with 50, 60 year olds on stage. Great. Just Ooh, imagine great. this. Having that, do you, had, the yeah. retirement home that, version. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. I'll come, I'm oh, coming back. <laughs> excellent. I can. I can. I, we can take a few years to plan that one. I think it okay. needs some time. Yeah, it's some time. Yeah. Okay. As, as a technical person, because my, my background for stage is technical. Okay. I have to ask you something. Yes. Um, behind us, we do see the stage here. Yes. And I've noticed that it's been the Medina stage is actually quite deep. It is very deep. Yes. Um, I noticed that you brought it in quite a bit. We did. Is there a reason for that? Well, we're using a screen for projections. Okay. Um, because we're traveling, it's hard to travel with set pieces. So we want to try a way to you know incorporate as much as we can into the show without needing a lot of things, mm -hmm. but also to add a modern feel to it. We wanted to add some projections. Uh, so to get the rear projection behind the screen, 
we have to move it further because you need to have that distance. Yeah. If you project from the front, it gets in the way of stage lights and yeah. people walk into shadows and things like that. Yeah. And then we also add a little bit of a riser to get a little bit of levels and things like that. Because you know, students in school, they like to sit around and chill and things like that. So yeah, yeah there's a few reasons why we did that. All right. Yeah. I mean, you got any last questions? Um, I don't think I do. Okay. No, I think I'm well, good. Do you have any last things that you want to tell us then? I don't think so. Or the, tell them. The Madinette Theatre, you need to come and see fame. We've traveled from Toronto, Ontario. We're right opening the show today at 4 o'clock. Uh, it's such an exciting show. Again, like I said, it's for the family all over, yeah. and um, you don't want to miss it. So. And they're getting ready behind us, and we're getting yeah. excited. So I'm you guys, excited. Yeah, yeah. Come and see Fame. Uh, it's ongoing till the 4th or 5th of March. We'll put that in the description. I don't know why I don't remember <laughs> this now. Uh, so thank you very much, and we'll see you soon. Awesome. Bye. Thanks, guys. Yep, thank, thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks. And thank, thank you for your time. Awesome. Thank you, yeah. guys. We'll let you get back <laughs> to you. what you need to do.